Hi! So this is my last and final attempt at making slime with essential oils. So if it doesn't work, I'm not doing it. This is fluffy slime, so I'm going to use shaving cream. About a cup, that's probably not much, but whatever, about a cup. I'm going to use about a cup of cornstarch or corn flour, depending on where you're from, or cool it. I'm going to use a couple of drops of on guard. So this is going to disinfect, really help boost your kids immune system or yours if you're playing with it. Um, I'm also going to, oh that smells awesome, I'm also going to chuck in some food colouring and I tried to make green earlier so let's try blue. So I'm just going to, I don't have long to, my phone's going to die so chuck it in there. <laughs> it's already pretty fluffy, but I think that's the shaving cream, but it's getting lighter. <laughs> it just wants to run away from me. Ah. Okay, let's try this spatula. Quick, quick, before the camera cuts out. I should have used a bigger bowl. <laughs> oh, but actually, I think this might be working compared to all the other slimes that haven't. It's really weird though, because I can smell some of the shaving cream but I can smell the essential oils as well so it feels, it's a really odd sensation in my nostrils <laughs> like half chemically half not if you can get non-scented shaving cream that would be much better for this Ooh, I think it's working but I think I'm gonna have to get my hands messy and I think my phone's gonna cut out so oh guys I really think this is working much better much better. I need a bigger bowl. Oh, it's working. It's working. This one's working. You've got 30 seconds before this runs out. So if I cut out and come back on and I'm slightly different, I apologise. Helper, he's come back in. This is fluffy slime. Are we gonna make that? It's worked. We already made it. Yeah, but where's the octopus slime? That's the one that didn't work. So can you, can you try and make this? This is the one that slime. cut out. And this, I would say, is a mixture between kinetic sand and Why? play doh. But kinetic it's really, sand. Yeah. What's kinetic sand? It's the sand that doesn't dry out that you can put in the water and you can cut it and it's just falls apart or you can shape it and it stays in the shape. Can this go in the water? I don't think this can go in the water because this is maybe a shaving cream and that would just probably dissolve. But it feels oh. really nice. It's nice to play with, isn't it? Mm -hmm. it feel, how does it feel? Nice. Does it feel soft? Sure. Yeah, I'm sure I make a snow angel. Sure, make a snow angel. Be Wow, that is awesome. You, okay, so I'm gonna scratch it up. <laughs> I just want to show you guys the texture. So it's cut, kind of comes across a bit crumbly, but it's so smooth if you just run your fingers across it. Like, it just smooths out. So it's it turns into like fluff. So it turns into all these little pieces. You can crumble it. You can smush it back together again. Oh my, my. And it's just really soft to play with. Say so bye. 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 Okay guys, so this is that fluffy slime and you can just see how stretchy it is and smooth. It feels 
really soft, like almost silky, and it's a bit like plasticine. Yeah, like I said, it's like in between kinetic sand and play-doh. But it's just really fun to play with. It's not as stretchy as your generic slime, but it's clearly the only slime that I can make. But it's so smooth and just really nice to play with, really satisfying and actually quite stress relieving. So that's quite nice. Um, and the orange will help you know, with anxiety and stress and just all those negative feelings melting away. So if you or your little one are getting a bit overwhelmed with anything, it's a great one to just get out and just. Ooh, that cut off right in there, isn't it? Just. Ooh. Fun, no, you can just cut it with your finger.